currently, LEDs aren't too hard to work with. Blinking an LED or just turning it on or off is relatively simple. But when you start to fade an LED on or make different kinds of cool effects, it begins to be excessive the amount of code it takes to do this. It takes loops and other functions just to create these effects. But now there's a new, simpler option, and this is a library called JLED. According to JLED's GitHub, it uses a non-blocking approach and can control LEDs in simple, on or off, and complex, blinking and breathing ways in a time-driven manner. Now, if you don't know what an LED is, an LED is a simple electronic light that just can turn on, off, or change its brightness. Now, let's learn how to use this library. Welcome to the mini tutorial. The way JLED works is we create JLEDs, and then we attach functions onto them. And then inside of the loop function, in order to keep these functions running, Every time it loops, we have to run the dot .update function on the LEDs. So, there are different things we can do, different built-in functions. First uh, of all is just a static on function, an on or an off, that turns an LED on or off. We also have these delay before or delay after functions, which simply do what they say. It either adds a delay before or after. We also have the off function, which works like on, but it turns the LED off. Next, we have blinking. And that is with the dot blink function, and it takes in parameters. There's also a forever function, which is a forever repeating loop. Next is breathing. That, as it says, it smooths the LED's brightness using pulse width modulation. And that's just the breathe function. And now we have fading functions. We can fade on an LED to 100% brightness, and we can fade off an LED. Now, you should go learn this library. You can make tons of different kinds of projects using the JLED library, so you, you should go learn it. Now, you can buy all the components in the description below. I have links to buy them on Amazon. You should just go do that and buy them so you can build these projects right away. And when you have it working, make sure to comment so everyone can see it.